athletes nationwide talking about the relief they're getting from Level Select CBD sports creams and roll-ons from Cadenwood, the leader in CBD. Baseball legend Steve Garvey with a national league record 1,207 consecutive games. Uses Level Select CBD daily. He swears by it. Countless other athletes, including former quarterback Carson Palmer, PGA champion Ricky Fowler, find Level Select CBD helps keep them in the game. It works for them. It can work for you, too. Level Select CBD has a full line of products to choose from. All independently tested, made in the USA, with 0% THC. Go to LevelSelectCBD.com. Use the promo code cbd 30 for 30% off any of their CBD products. That's LevelSelectCBD.com and the promo code CBD30. Also available at Food Lion. Not available in Idaho, Iowa, and South Dakota. On Monday, President Trump said that he's narrowed down his list of nominees for the Supreme Court vacancy to five people. He'll likely announce the choice by Friday or Saturday following funeral services for Justice Ginsburg. He's urging the Senate to act quickly and hold a vote before the election. And Democrats are livid. Nancy Pelosi floated the idea of impeaching him again to delay the nomination. Radical Democrats calling for their fringe base to take to the streets again. They're demanding that Republicans honor Justice Ginsburg's supposed dying wish to wait until after the election to fill the vacancy. And of course, the Democrats and the media are harping on the failed nomination of Merrick Garland following the death of Justice Scalia as a reason to wait. Now, the the Democrats and their media lackeys, they can whine, they can moan, they can threaten all they want. The president is charged by the Constitution to fill the vacancy. The Senate is charged to advise and consent, which is exactly what happened with Garland. Obama named him and the Senate withheld consent. Justice Ginsburg's dying wish has no force of law. It's not her seat. And neither do protests or complaints or revisionist history. The only thing that matters in filling a Supreme Court vacancy is the Constitution. And as usual, that's what the Democrats are opposing. That's what they're intent on ignoring, the Constitution. Screw that, they say. (laughs) 